Hey y'all, I'm Shayna and I'm back with another review. This is for Put A Ring On It. This is the season finale. And y'all, <laughs> I work like 12 hours a day, so I'm exhausted. I didn't take no notes, you know. I, sometimes I just wing it. I go rogue. Like, that's just, sometimes that's just what I like to do. So, we doing that today. Sorry, I thought I heard a noise. <laughs> If y'all hear any noises in the back, you know, that's just my kids. They got the TV on loud. But anyway, so I did my best just to keep my eyes open because it was a little bit boring. But I'm going to try to go ahead and get through this uh, <laughs> so we can get it out the way because the reunion looks like it might be a little bit spicy. So, oh, before I forget, if you're new here and you enjoy this type of content, check out my other videos. Some of them are structured. <laughs> Some of them are not. But either way, subscribe to the channel, like, comment. And yeah, I know we want to get to the nitty gritty. They had to fill up the episode with a bunch of talk. So, so I believe we started off the episode. Somebody was meeting with somebody's parents. I don't know, child. Jason met with Joya's dad. Joya's dad's been married for 40 plus years. So he felt like he's a good person to get marital advice from. But Joya's dad is Team Joya. And he like, look, her biological clock is ticking. When do you want to have some babies? And I said, not pushing the babies before you pushing him to put a ring on it. This is put a ring on it, not put a baby in it. <laughs> but he like, look, I want more grandchildren. He said he got a trillion grandchildren and only one of them are from Joya. So he wants some more. If you got all them grandkids, why are you so concerned? But... That's the wisdom he want to give after being married for all them years. He said something else, but I had got distracted by my phone. Then we saw Zay. He meets with Jasmine's mom. And I said, okay, mom. Mom had on the sequence underneath the uh, the fuzzy sweater and <laughs> the cleavage out. I said, okay. You see what Jasmine, what Jasmine going to give in a couple years. They are twins. It's so cute. It's like he's going out with an older version of Jasmine. But Jasmine's mama finally put his feet to the fire and was like, why didn't you propose when you gave that childish high school like promise ring? And he said it wasn't the time. It wasn't. They wasn't ready. So y'all was ready to live together and play house. But putting getting engaged was just too much. Like make it like you are too old. Whew. But mama going along with it because she just love him so much. And she know he more than likely going to put a ring on it. I mean, that's just what they do. That's, <laughs> I haven't seen anybody not putting a ring on it on this show yet. But we're going to see. We're going to have to keep going with it. Then we saw uh, Dr. Stacy met with a few people. She met with Ricky. Why? I don't know. She know he playing games. And she basically trying to get down to the bottom of it. Like, are you ready? He said he's ready to get engaged. How are you ready to marry anybody when you got your girlfriend living in the house with your family and you sleeping on your ex-wife slash baby mama's couch. When you babysit, it's too much going on. Sharing a car, like you ain't ready for nothing. You're not even ready to take care of yourself. Or get a haircut. <laughs> so, no, he's not ready. But, he claims he is. He might be getting ready to marry somebody. But he ready to waste Catherine's time. Like, all of her time. He's wasted enough. I think Catherine met with, uh, they were talking about something. She met and she's blaming herself for her anger issues. I wish she would stop doing that. Like she really let him like mind trick her. Like he don't got issues. He has issues as well. The red flags is on fire, but for some reason she just taking all the blame. Like it's just her. It's y'all, not you. <laughs> who else? Who else had a mean? I don't know. Either way. What do we want to get to? The proposals. That's what this is really about in the reunion. So we start off with Jazz and Zang. And she's like, oh, he put together this romantic day. He's not on his phone. I have his undivided attention. Aren't y'all filming for a show? Of course. <laughs> he can't be sitting on his phone and y'all filming. Like, let's see what he do when the camera crew leaves. But they put together a nice, nicely well a well thoughtful, well lit proposal with all the sunflowers is her favorite flower, paid for by own. And then he gets on his ring and she really starts crying. I said, Oh my gosh, she loves this man. Like those was real tears. She didn't force nothing. 
She'd been waiting on this day. And of course she said, yeah, why would she say no? She'd been waiting on this day. Her mama been waiting too. <laughs> so I'm glad she finally got her ring. Let's not drag this on another however many years for the wedding. Please, let's just move on. We've waited long enough. Then we see Catherine and Ricky. Mm, 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 mm. So Catherine put on her sequence dress and she like, ooh, that's a romantic date. And you know, it had to be something because they don't go on dates. She said he don't take her on dates. He don't buy flowers. He don't this. He don't that. He's not intimate. He's just not nothing. <laughs> like, oh, why do you even want to marry this man? Even when the episode started, I forgot with that cliffhanger from last week. And she going to start it off. Tomorrow. I know who I want. I want Ricky. Why? At this point, just choose you. Choose yourself. What do you, what? What is she seeing that we're not seeing? Maybe they edited it out because I ain't see it. <laughs> but they sit on the date. And he going to say, oh, I think we should commercial break back. We should wait to get married because you got to work on your anger issues. Oh, <sighs> Catherine, run, don't walk. Run, don't walk. Get a move on. Get your bags packed and go back to your mama's house. You don't got to stay with his family. Leave. Bounce. Get up out of there. You don't even got no kids. I'll be out of there so fast. By the time he finished that statement, I'd have already been on the next flight back to Dallas. And why didn't you pick um, Marcus or whatever his name was? But they said they're going to work on it. She looked very disappointed, but try to justify his nonsense. This is put a ring on it. Now, what I wanted was for somebody to go off with one of the people they was dating. That would be an unusual plot twist. But since we didn't have that, I guess we had to have Ricky... Just disappointing Catherine again. We've seen it all season long. We don't need to see no more. Joy and Jason. Jason gets a thoughtful proposal. She wants a picnic. He finally took her on one. Um, he had some random white people dancing in the back. It was a whole thing. And he proposed. Of course, she says yes. Now, these two, I think they're going to... I don't know. Because he knows she wants that baby. And I don't think he wants one. So, he might drag on this engagement. But I feel like they're probably going to get married right away. Now, Zay, he might, he talking about, he get cold feet. He might drag that engagement on. It might be forever fiancés for a while <laughs> before they make it down that aisle. But, uh, Catherine, I don't know who you want to marry, but it ain't ever, ever going to be Ricky. We'll see. Because it looked like she was still with him. She was still shoulder to shoulder with him at the uh, reunion. Why? Please, I would have been sitting across from him. Pay him dust. Leave. Like, he literally, you can't even work on yourself because you're too busy running around his kids and his nieces and nephews. Like, the whole situation is bad, and he can't even get you flowers. Ugh, he gives me the ick. But I wasn't really surprised by any of this. Let me know what y'all are thinking. Are you ready for the reunion? Because that's what I'm really ready for. I'll stay awake and take some notes on that one. <laughs> but drop down in the comments. Be sure to check out my other videos, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.